Main argument used to defend this transatlantic treaty is its positive impact on jobs and growth. Actually, the only pseudo-study that the Commission is using would, would mean that basically this would create 0.5% additional growth over 10 years that is even less than the margin of error of such studies. But actually, let's look at those who ask for this treaty. It's AmCham and it's Business Europe, the federations of large multinationals, who want this, who want this treaty exactly to boost the profit margins of the large multinationals. Well, we believe that this is not worth such a, a defeat of democracy.